balance ng napaka creamy niya. Meron siyang strong aroma na hindi ko malaman. Parang herb. I'm afraid yung fish parang masyadong na-overcook. I'll give it a name. Chicken was so tender as well. So overall rating ko dito, I'm gonna say I'll give it. What's up everybody? This is Nims from Bangu Media. Welcome to another food review episode. Nandito tayo ngayon sa Mall of Asia sa Seaside Boulevard. May nakita na naman akong restaurant and I haven't tried this before. It's an Indian restaurant and nakita ko yung mga reviews dito sa restaurant na to uh, is magaganda. Yung rate nila is actually 4 star, 5 star and yung famous biryani rice nila. So, um, to try din natin yung guys and tara na, pasok na tayo sa loob. Let's check it out. Nandito na tayo sa loob ng Royal Indian um, Curry House. Bago kayo pumunta dito, you need to make sure dalhin yung vaccination card nyo and before entering the establishment, always sanitize your hands. What's good um, about this restaurant is also meron silang alfresco and they do have also their mini bars here. So, kung gusto nyo ng wine, tequila or something, beer, uh, meron din sila dito. Pag natin yung menu nila guys. What's on their menu, they do have their specialties like yung mga soup and uh, mga beef curries. Then, meron din silang seafoods dito and yung biryani nila. So yung biryani nila, um, hindi ko pa alam kung ano. Uh, I mean yung biryani kasi, hindi ko alam kung rice siya. But yun nga, napaka famous yun sa India kasi parang um, yun yung pinaka rice nila doon. And I haven't tried it as well. Tapos, meron din sila dito palang mga, um, mga soup, uh, more on cur um, curry, tomato, um, tomato-based food sila. So, tara, order na tayo guys. So, after 10 minutes, order is complete. And, unahin naman natin tikman yung naan bread nila. So, ito yung pinaka-famous bread sa India. Um, pwede mo siya isaw-saw kung saan-saan. Like, dun sa mga ulam nila. Like, yung mga curry, ganyan. So, this is how you do it. Yan. Nakamay-kamay lang siya. Ganyan. Or kung pa-social ka naman, gamit kang tinapay, pero hindi tayo social. So. <laughs> hindi ko alam kung anong flavor nito, pero ang weird ng lasa niya, sobrang asin. Parang hindi siya bagay dito sa, sa bread natin. Pero siguro kung itatry natin siya sa ibang sauce, kasi pwede naman siya talaga dun ay partner, ito yung pinaka-rice nila. But then again, yung bread is so um, nice. Um, malasa siya. Hindi siya maalit na yung wala siyang flavor. Sa plain lang siya, perfect siya sa lahat. Kung isasoso mo siya sa mga ibang dippings natin or sa mga ibang in-order natin. So, great dish. So next naman natin, tikman is yung fish curry nila. Lasang-lasang mo talaga yung curry nila guys. But I'm afraid yung fish parang masyadong na-overcook. So madali siyang madulog sa um, sa mouth mo, sa bunga nga mo pag kinain mo siya. And siguro perfect to with the biryani rice or any rice. Highly recommend din, din to guys. But then again, yun nga. Um, siguro pag order tayo nito, make sure na lang sabihin natin na wag i-overcook yung, um, yung fish. But overall, was a great dish. Thumbs up for this. So next naman natin tikman is yung merg mukha ni nila. So merg makani is actually a parang chicken curry siya dito. So tikman na natin guys. Mm. Hindi yung pagkalaso ng curry, hindi siya ganun kaalat. 
And balance so napaka creamy niya. Para siyang ano um aldereta na may curry powder or may flavor in a curry powder. And yung chicken niya was so tender. Um nandun din may nandun din yung saltiness, then yung peppery taste ng chicken. Overall, highly recommend this dish. So try niyo din guys. Last but not the least, we have the chicken biryani, one of the best seller dito sa restaurant na to. So, tikman na natin guys. So, yung texture niya parang ano, parang pansit ganun, pero rice siya. Meron siyang strong aroma na hindi ko malaman, parang herb yung lasa niya. Hindi ko lang kung anong klase ng herb, but yun nga, na ang strong niya, pero tama lang. Hindi siya makakapekto sa pagkain mo. And yung chicken was so tender as well. The rice is full of flavors, and hindi siya masyadong maalag. May pagka-sweet siya ng konti. Maybe because of the curry, and siguro yung sauce nito. But overall, this was a great dish. Um, hindi ko in-expect na ganito yung lasa niya, and I love it. So, tara, ubusin na natin to, guys. Tapos na tayong kumain. I-rate naman natin sila isa-isa ngayon. So, first natin i-rate. Play na ang... I'll give it an 8. Next naman yung chicken biryani nila. I'll give it a 9. Next naman is yung merged mercani. I'll give it an 8. Last nating i-rate is yung um, fish curry nila. I'll give it an 8. Overall rating ko dito, I'm gonna say I'll give it an 8. Total bill namin is Um, 2032 and 52 cents. So, bakit siya naging ganun? Because of the bath and the service charge. So, ang, ang lahat talaga ng in-order namin is, ang total niya is 1,666. Sulit naman ba? I must say, sakto lang. Kasi, if you are actually on a tight budget, hindi ito yung right restaurant para sa'yo. Yung mga foods that they serve is actually great. Again, iba-iba naman tayo ng mga refer um, preference and panlasa. In my opinion, um, I highly recommend this restaurant to you guys. So, thank you guys for watching and I hope you like this video. And please do not forget to hit like, subscribe, and share. And hit the notification bell para lagi kang updated sa mga future videos namin. This is Nice from Bangor Media. See you on our next video. Bye!